You can travel all around the world riding on your little bicycle. You cross rivers, climb up the mountains, and you meet so many friends. Mook, mook, from Arctic to Canada to forest in Alaska. Mook, mook, can you tell me what you see? Pajamas? These are yukatas, traditional Japanese clothes. They suit you well, Mook. You look like samurais. So you're still in Japan? Yes. Today was our last day in Tokyo. Already? Wow. You must have seen loads of really tall buildings, high-tech gadgets and people everywhere. <laughs> Actually, we saw the opposite today. Really? What do you mean? Well, we were in the middle of Tokyo City and we had no time to lose. Faster! Faster! Brake! Quick! Speed up! Left! W watch out! Oh no! Speed up! No! Slow down! You're going too fast! No way! I want to beat the best time for this run! Watch out! Oh no! One second too late! Let's play another game. We haven't got time. Miko will be here any minute. I'm going to miss staying with her. Me too. Hey! There she is! Hello! Konnichiwa, Miko. So, are you all ready for our last trip together? I can't believe it's our last day in Tokyo already. Well, don't worry. I have something special lined up for you today. Really? What? I want to show you the other Japan. What other Japan? You've seen the busy big city, but Japan is also famous for being a place of peace and calm. Japan? Peaceful? <laughs> yes, it can be. Come on, we're meeting my father. Then you'll see what I mean. All right, all right, I'll be right over. I'll do my very, very best. Thank you. Yes, I'll see you soon. Yes. All sunglasses are on sale today. Try some on. They're all on sale. It's just as noisy as ever. Maybe Miko was joking about showing us somewhere peaceful. Here we are. This is certainly something different. This is what I wanted to show you. Today is Midori no He. Midori what? Midori no He. Greenery Day. It's a holiday when the whole country celebrates how beautiful nature is. It's a time to enjoy the trees, the flowers, the scenery. And so later today, my father and I are going to open a new garden to the public. Would you like to see it? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. There you are, Miko. Hi, Dad. Konnichiwa, Takahashi-san. I said Mook and Chevapa could come and see the garden before it opens. There are big problems with our new garden. Everything is going wrong today. It's supposed to open tonight, and lots of people have been invited, but we're never going to finish on time. I've still got lots to do here. I won't have time to go and fetch the lanterns or the most important piece from the nursery. Can we help at all? Yes. Maybe there is something we can do. You're very kind. Miko, you could go and get the lanterns and Mook and Chavapa, you could go to the plant nursery while I finish up here. OK, Dad. No, no problem. problem. Here, it's a note for the man at the plant nursery. Thank you for your help. I'm going to carry on working here. Let's go. See you later, Dad. That's great. But you must be back before sunset or it will be too late. OK. and Chevapa, thanks for going to get the tree. See you in a bit. See you. Tree? How are we going to carry a whole tree? We only have bicycles, you know, not a truck. Why did we say we'd do this? It's too late now. We've promised. We'll just have to do the best we can. Huh. You're impossible. You can't go out 
out without oh. your shoes. Okay, let's go. I love your suit. Hey, there's the bridge. The nursery is on the other side. I'm sorry. The bridge is damaged and no one is allowed to cross. We don't have time for delays. What are we going to do? Maybe if I explain to her. Uh, konnichiwa. We, um, we have to collect something important for our friend. We have to pick up an important tree from the plant nursery and get back in time for this new garden that's opening tonight. You must take a different route. But we have to get back to the garden by sunset. The other route will take longer. It's rush hour, so there's a lot of traffic about. But we promised to be back in time. Ah. Hello, yes. We've got a problem. Could you come, please? OK. Oh, no. I hope we aren't in trouble. Time's oh, running out. Look! Oh, no. What's wrong? What did we do? Please, follow me. What's happening? I think we're getting a special police escort. You know, we still have one slight problem. What's that? How are we going to carry a whole tree back to the garden? Here you are, Dad. Thank you, Miko. Thank you. I'll wait for you here. See you in a bit. I knew it. There's no way we can carry any of these trees. I think this is a red-leafed maple, just the kind we need for the garden. We'd better ask the nursery owner. He might have an idea what we can do. Konnichiwa. Hello. Hello. We've come on behalf of Mr Takahashi. Ah, Mr Takahashi. Wait here. I'll be right back. Maybe we can bend the tree. You can't bend trees. But maybe if we laid it across the two bikes... Then we'd be covering the whole road. What if we tried to put wheels under it? Here you go. But where's the tree? Ah, I know what that is. Now I understand. I wish I did. Why is it so small? This is a miniature bonsai maple tree. Just like a real tree, but much, much tinier. They're very popular in Japan. You are right, my young friend. This is a chokai bonsai, a tree of great age and beauty. We'll have the special showpiece tree back at the garden in plenty of time for the opening. Easy. We are at the garden. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. Rook, Chavapa, you had a special escort. You two really are amazing. Well, we did it. <laughs> it's okay, Dad. They're back. Arigato gozaimasu. He's thanking us. Do atashimashite. I told him he's welcome. Thanks to you, the garden's ready. Come and see. Wow, 
It's a miniature garden. Our bonsai looks almost like a real maple tree. Yeah, and those small rocks look like islands on a lake. Exactly. Now you've got the idea. A Japanese garden brings the peace of the countryside into a noisy city. Each object represents a much bigger object from nature, so the bonsai tree is like a real tree. And a rock can be like a mountain. And the white gravel reminds us of a beautiful lake. Miko said she'd show us a different, peaceful Japan, and here it is, all in one garden. Good job getting that garden open in time. I can't believe you got a special police escort. <laughs> a tiny tree in the middle of all those huge buildings. Now I know what you meant when you said Japan can be modern and traditional at the same time. Hey! Maybe we can borrow Dad's cactus plant to have as our very own bonsai tree. Good idea. Maybe you too can make your own small garden. Small, small is beautiful! <laughs> <laughs>